<laughs> I, I, I love, in general, like, last thing about the podcast, like, I love it so much. Like, again, the whole reason why I started doing music was to help others. And and I always, I always say that, like, I'm in mm. the business. Like, I may be a mixer, but I'm really in the business of instilling confidence in people. People come to me, artists come to me, producers come to me feeling insecure about a project. They leave feeling like they're the best damn artist or producer in the world. Like, that's mm. what I want. It's not about the sound. It's about the confidence. So, um, I love that. And like you said, yeah, like, I love that's it. That's so important. People, mm-hmm. Yeah. And I, I love it when people on the Discord, our Discord or whatever, they're like, yo, I got some clients this week because of you. Or like, they listen to my motivational business stuff. Uh, and they're like, oh my gosh, like, I've been feeling insecure. And I feel like I've gotten over that. Or like, there's so many, I have people that DM me every single day. And it's just like, that's what I do this for. I don't give a shit about the money or the clients. It's more about if I can instill confidence in people. I'm happy. Yeah. I mean, I think that's like, I mean, specifically thinking about mastering, like what, what does a mastering engineer bring? It brings peace of mind, right? The mastering engineer, like to, to quote Sam Moses. And it's, it's totally true. Like, you know, when, when the mastering engineer says the project is done and now you have confidence to put this out, that this is a finalized, complete, you know, record, you know, and, and that, and that's totally true down the chain as well. Like with a mixing engineer say, no, this is your song and this is mixed and it sounds great. And you know, the, you know, the recording engineer is saying the same thing. No, that vocal sounded awesome. You know what I mean? And, and, and that kind of, that confidence is so important. And I, and I've, I've been learning just, just working with artists over, over years of just like, the more I'm confident in telling them these things, the better they feel about the product and the better they feel about their art and their music. And you, you know, you got to just be, obviously you have to be, you know, you have to tell it like it is, but you know, you got to give you got to give them the the strength to to move on, you know, so to speak.